Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube introduction video. And if you were following me for uh, some time and you were watching my tutorials, well, you might hear that my uh, sound is quite crappy because my microphone was very old and was not uh, not supported to use uh, to record a YouTube videos. And as you can see, I bought a new microphone. This was quite expensive. It's a Blue Yeti, one of the pro microphones used for YouTubers. And I think that this will help me to record a better videos. So for, for a few months, uh, I was writing our enforcement learning tutorials. And this was uh, really hard to do that because they required from me a lot of time and effort to learn everything step by step and to write my own reinforcement learning algorithms to do quite simple stuff but yeah th this took me a lot of time and this required for from me a lot of, of effort and I made this series actually I finished that series and then I thought what I could make next and during this time, while I was uh, learning reinforcement learning, a lot of you were writing me with same and similar uh, questions. How to solve the object detection uh, YOLO problems? Well, actually, most of you were facing problem that uh, this tutorial was written for TensorFlow 1.15, and a lot of you were using the second version of TensorFlow. This is my new, newest version. And this my tutorials were not supported for this version. You couldn't train your models or if you have trained them, you can't use them on ten TensorFlow 2.0. So actually what I decided that it's uh, time to, for me to rewrite these tutorials. Actually, I'm not going to cover the theory. Well, maybe a little bit because well, I, I'm learning this from zero again. I need to renew my knowledge because time goes and I also am human and I can forget everything. So simply I will do them from zero again and I will try to write a model that we could try the uh, object detection with original uh, darknet weights. We could, for example, train our own custom weights, how to make your custom own data set, for example, and how to prepare labeled images, where, for example, you could download these images and so on. I'll try to cover. Well, actually, my goal is to, most of the first goal is to, how to make it trainable. And when I'll finish this, I'll try to write or record these tutorials and put them on YouTube. And then I'll try to write some codes, for example, how to convert this to TensorFlow Lite, how to use this on Raspberry, how to use this in real-time detection, or, or even I'll try to run this on my own car while I'm driving the city and we'll see how it detects. But I'm not sure right now and I can't promise for you, but actually I am. I just ran a model how to use YOLO weights, darknet original weights for real-time detection. And here I have a short video from, from internet and uh, for example, we're car driving, driving the city and I'll show it for you. And it's making a detection. And while I'm recording, the speed of detection is lower but actually it was uh, around 59 uh, milliseconds it's around 60 frames per second it's quite low but my goal is not to make it super optimized model i actually would like to make it work and be trainable and maybe with your help we could improve it later and make it work for example faster as as the original Darknet uh, is working and as you can see it it works quite accurately and It's detecting everything persons cars the most objects you can see here 
and what I'll try to do is that we could make a custom our custom detection as I was doing in my previous tutorials where I made a uh, counter-strike shooting game with bot for example well, well it was quite interesting tutorial by you well now I'll try something different we'll see I don't know right now actually right now I'm working on custom detection and we'll see how it works and yeah, soon I will upload this and moreover, right now I will do the tutorial how you could train your own model on Google Colab because a lot of you were asking for this because yeah, you don't have that that GPUs required for training on your own computers, but of course you would like to test this. So, see you quite soon in my coming tutorials with object detection and we'll see what I can do and how I can help for you. So see you and goodbye. Have a nice day.